it sounds complex but I think you won't find it too hard. So a couple of things that we need to know before we start. Prime numbers. Prime numbers that have only themselves and one as factor. Factors. So an example of a prime number is seven because it's only made up of seven times one. Okay, another example would be 13. 13 times one. No other factors. On the other hand, composite numbers are numbers like six, where we've got six times one, but we've also got two times three. So it's got more than one pair of factors. So let's just start with looking at the prime factors of um, a number like 12. So the first thing we do is we create a number tree. So writing down the number 12. And then we will choose, obviously 12 is not a prime number, it's a composite number and it's made up of multiple factors. So let's start with um, 3 times 4. So 3 times 4 equals 12. 3 is a prime number, so we can't do anything more with that. However, 4 can be broken down into 2 times 2. So the prime factors of 12 are 2 times 2 times 3. If we multiply them together, 2 times 2 is 4, times 3 is 12. Now, 3 times 4 is where we started, but it doesn't matter uh, if we started with the other factors of 12. So the other factors of 12 that we could use is obviously 2 times 6. 2 is a prime number and 6 is a composite number which can be broken into 2 by 3. And again we get the same prime factors. So whichever way you do it, it doesn't matter what numbers you start with as long as you end up with all prime numbers at the bottom. Now the other thing that we need you to know is that when we have a number multiplied by itself, we can write it in a different way. You can write 2 by 2 as 2 squared. That means 2 times itself twice. Times 3 equals 12. Okay, and that's all there is to it. One more quick example of um, creating prime factors is if I take the number 48 and We'll break that down. 4 times 12. Neither of those are prime factors. 4 we can break down into 2 by 2. And 2 are prime numbers. 12 we can break down into 2 and 6. 2 is a prime number, but 6 isn't. And 6 we can break down to 2 and 3, both of which are prime numbers. So the prime factors of 48 are 2 by 2 by 2 by 2 by 3. So if we were to write that in index form, that's 2 to the power of 4 times 3. And that is equal to 48. So that's prime decomposition. Good luck with that.